Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker Dean Hop Realtors. Today I'm in the master plan community of Ladera on the west side of San Antonio. And the tour we're gonna to do today is of David Weekly's model home, the Vera Cruz plan. This is just over 2,000 square feet. It's a three bedroom, two bath, two car garage. It is being built on a 45 foot lot. Now, typically I like 55 foot lots or higher, but it all depends on what your budget is telling you you can afford. So these 45 foot lots should be a consideration because yes, it's pretty good bang for the buck. All right, let's head out front and start the tour. Like I said before, David Weekly is definitely one of my favorite builders. That's why I do so many video tours of them. Uh, tax rate in Ladera, you're looking right around 2.5. Um, there is a public improvement district tax, a PID. That's what's bringing the tax rate up to 2.5. HOA fees, you're looking at about $850 a year. There is an elementary school in this community. Uh, right down the road, you got Petranco, which is going to be your HEB. All of your urban sprawl stuff is all right there, just uh, like a five-minute drive from here. So very conveniently located. Speaking about convenient, you're about a 10-minute drive to Lackland Air Force base so if that's one of your requirements to be close to definitely check out this community all right let's head on inside uh if you haven't done so already hit that like button of course i want you to be subscribed to my channel because i do these videos to try to provide as much information as possible and hopefully you reach out to me and use me as your real estate agent now this is where the two car garage would be but they're using it as their office so pay no attention to that Right up front, you're going to have your two bedrooms. So here's the decent sized bedrooms. I'm not going to say they're big, but they're decent. Checking out their closet. And they're going to be sharing this bathroom, which people that were just in here left the toilet up. There we go. All right. So you're going to have your kind of your standard uh, bathroom. And then you're gonna have, they're using this room here to kind of showcase their energy efficiency. Uh, David Weekly does build a very energy efficient house. They do the two by sixes versus your two by fours. Double stuff the installation, use the PAC system, which pretty much every new construction builder is using PACs now for water, making it less chances of uh, a freeze if it does happen again to cause any damage. But yeah, they are very energy efficient rating. They do have like the home team uh, portals on the outside if you want to do uh, pest control that way. But yes, they are very energy efficient builders. And uh, I know way too much about David Weekly and I really do like their business model, how they take care of people and the quality of house that they build. This would be coming in from your garage, so you would have a little mud room right there, a little bitty baby mud room section for your backpacks. Your laundry room, decent sized laundry room space with a little uh, table. Now, I forgot to mention this is a model home, so David Weekly has put all the bells and whistles in here to really showcase what they can do. So, what you see here, you can do, but it would cost more than what their typical price is for one of their, what they call quick move-in homes slash inventory homes, which are still the best bang for the buck is to buy a house that's already in the build process and even better bang for the buck to find something that's completed and sitting because that's when builders are really desperate to get those homes moved. But coming into this uh, main living space, you can see you've got a decent sized kitchen, a really good sized island there. This is a quartz countertop. They are using Frigidaire appliances. And I'm not gonna forget the pantry. I'm not gonna say this is a large pantry, but it is a pantry. This isn't the biggest of homes. It is a 2,000 square foot home. So not something you're gonna have if you got a huge family, so you really don't need a huge closet. This is a gas community, so there's your five top cooktop. I'll do like the uh, selections that they made for the backsplash, kind of neat. And I do like how uh, you got your single basin sink. And one of the things David Wiggly likes to do is like to be able to see majority of the house from the kitchen, especially from like behind the sink there. You can see a lot of stuff on the house. All right, you got your main living space. I do like how it's kind of really squared off. Um, 
David Weekly is real conscious about windows and still being able to use the walls behind it or below it. So they got these little portal windows up there allowing extra light in, but still giving you space to use, the, put a couch there. And plenty of space on the wall to put your entertainment center. But yes, this is one of those things like, uh, folks that were just here, it's like they took pictures of this because it's so easy to do, just go down to Lowe's buy some wood, tack it up, paint it, and it makes a really cool accent space. Um, your dining room space, plenty good size. Once again, windows giving you lots of natural light. And this side here is your office, which I was showing it earlier. If you're building from dirt, you can have this closed in if you wanted to. It's all up to you and what your desires are. All right, let's head on out back. But yes, it is a very energy efficient home. All right, let's check out the backyard space. Pretty good sized backyard space here. Uh, they do have two, two ceiling fans out here. Um, if you're building, they, the inventory homes might have just the lights out there, but they would be blocked for putting ceiling fans in. All the builders are gonna do that. So remember their 45 foot lots, they're gonna be a little bit longer so when you got a house that's a little bit longer versus wide, you're not gonna have as deep as backyard space, but it all depends on your lifestyle and what you're looking for, because a lot of folks don't, aren't really looking for a huge backyard, but it does come with a sprinkler system. Uh, you're gonna have 10 feet between each houses, so it's gonna be five foot on each side. So you can see the difference between uh, where the houses are in this part of this community. There's other parts of this community that are gonna be wider lots. And of course, meaning a little more space, but going back to what I said before, bang for the buck, um, you're gonna be a pretty good price point in this section. And if you're waiting before, why don't you tell us what the price is? I will have a current list of what the quick move-ins, their move-in ready homes are the house that are being processed, they're going to be at the final slide. So you can see what those prices are, but really good sized master bedroom in here. Do like how they did the designs on the back. Lots of nice windows, very energy efficient. And, uh, coming through here, they do have, because this is a model home, they are showcasing their David weekly super shower. It's what they call them. This is an upgrade. But in my opinion, it's definitely worth the upgrade to go with a super shower if you're building from dirt. So you can just walk in, your two vanities, and uh, let's see, that's gonna be the little linen closet. Pretty sure. Uh, here's your uh, main closet area. Now, for a second, I thought this was the linen closet. It's not the linen closet, this is your old water closet, so there's your toilet right there. So kind of right out, right inside the uh, bathroom door. All right, give me one last look at this house. Remember this isn't the biggest house, it's just over 2,000 square feet, but uh, it all depends on what you're looking for and what you're trying to be close to. I do like the fact that you've got easy access to Petranka Road, the HEB grocery store, 10 minutes from Lackland Air Force Base. Very convenient if you need to be on this side of town. Definitely come by and check this place out. All right, that's gonna do it for the video tour of David Weekly's model home in Ladera Ranch. Remember, this is the Vaquera plant. Don't click off just yet. I got some great information for you. One of which is the next slide is gonna have all of David Weekly's quick move in slash inventory homes that's on the market as of 1 September 2024. Another thing is to remind you that the builder, David Weekly, does pay my realtor fees. So please don't hesitate to reach out to me. I'll be happy to help. Best way to contact me is to go to the next slide after that one, and you will see all my contact information. If you want to schedule a Zoom meeting with me, that link is gonna be in the description box. 
One more thing I'm gonna be doing, if you're using me to build as your realtor to build from dirt, I'm only paying for a third party inspector to come through and do a pre sheetrock inspection because in my opinion, that's the most important inspection because once the sheetrock goes up, it's really hard to see what's going on behind the walls. All right, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, but most importantly, if you know somebody moving to the area and they don't already have a real estate agent, please share this video with them. I'll be happy to help. Take care now, bye.